Today, I'll be teaching as to how to find an optimum lag in R. Kindly check my earlier videos relating to R for basic steps. So the data is on the file where I've got two variables, GDP and FDI. So I'll check over my file over here. So view has appeared. The next command is you have to attach it, then only you can find the optimum lag. So my file name is VECM. So when it prompts, try to click over to avoid mistakes. Later, click enter. So when this work is done, the next is to find the optimal lag, you have to install a package called VARS. So for that, go to tools, go to install packages, type VARS. So I have already installed it, so I am not going to install it once again, so I am going to cancel it again. After that, type the command library and type vars package and then click enter. Now everything is set, so we have to do the optimum lag for a single variable first. So the command will be var select. So I am just taking the optimal lag for the variable GDP. So it is in caps. So I have to click here. Any small mistake, the R will never show the answer. Though I am just clicking enter. So I have got the results. There are four criterions. One is AIC, HQ, SC, FPE. So the optimal lag for all the criterions are two. So this is the optimal lag for a single variable. Now if you have got two variables, what will be the command? So we will check over that. For that you have to type was select. Later type data dot frame type the variables GDP then a comma FDI so like this you can just put a comma and type n number of variables later click enter so the results have propped up so you can see as usual, there are four criterions. One is AIC, HQ, SC, FPE. So the optimal lag based on AIC criterion is 9. That of HQ is 3 and that of SC is 2. It is left to the researcher to, to decide as to which criterion is opt for. Whatever criterion he or she opts for, it has to be mentioned in the research work. But however, the best criterion is AIC. But the greatest drawback is the optimal lag is more here, which means that uh, lots of uh, degrees of freedom is lost. So it is the best method is to select the criterion which, uh, which shows a less lag, optimal lag. So I'll be selecting two for my further analysis. Hope you are clear with this. Thank you for listening.